Hello, I'm Edward and welcome to WindowsReport.com. In this video, I will show you what to do if CC Cleaner is not deleting Firefox history. CC Cleaner is a long established utility used to clean potentially unwanted files and invalid Windows registry entries from a computer. And some Windows 10 users claimed that CC Cleaner does not clear Firefox history, making the browser load and run slower. So let's take a look at how to solve this issue in no time. For a more detailed explanation and even more solutions, please check the article in the description below. The first solution could be making sure that you have the latest version of CC Cleaner. If CC Cleaner can delete Firefox history, you might be able to fix that by updating the CC Cleaner to the latest version. Many users reported this issue on their Windows 10 PCs and according to them, the easiest solution is to perform an update. So simply download and install the latest version of CC Cleaner and check if that solves the issue. You can also select Internet Cache option in CC Cleaner. If you have any issues with Firefox and CC Cleaner and you can't delete Firefox history, you might want to try this solution. To do this, just start CC Cleaner and when CC Cleaner starts, go to the Cleaner or Custom Clean section. Now click the Applications tab and locate Firefox on the list. Make sure that Internet Cache option is checked. After doing that, run the scan and check if that solves the problem. Another great solution is making sure that Firefox is closed. If you can delete Firefox history using CC Cleaner, you need to be sure that Firefox isn't running in the background. So to do that, you have to press Ctrl plus Shift plus Escape to open Task Manager. And when Task Manager starts, go to Processes tab and locate Firefox. Right-click Firefox and choose End Task from the menu. Be sure to close all Firefox processes. Additionally, you can also navigate to the Details tab and close Firefox.exe processes from there by following the similar steps. After closing all Firefox processes, start CC Cleaner and try to remove Firefox history again. Another useful solution is deleting cookies.sqlite and permissions.sqlite. Open Firefox, then click on the menu button in the top right corner, and then click on the Help button. Then select Troubleshooting Information. And in the Troubleshooting Information tab, click the Open Folder button, which is situated next to the Profile folder. After doing that, your Firefox Profile folder will appear. Now you can simply locate and delete the cookies.sqlite and permissions.sqlite files. Keep in mind that you need to close Firefox completely in order to delete those files. Alternatively, you can open your Firefox profile by following these steps. Press the Start button in the lower left corner and simply type Run. And press on Run. Then when the Run dialog opens, just enter the following command, press Enter or click OK. Now the Profiles folder will appear. Just enter the folder that represents your profile. And after you access your Firefox profile folder, just delete cookies.sqlite and permissions.sqlite files. Few users reported that they were unable to delete those files even after closing Firefox. So if that happens, just restart your PC and try to delete the files again. Another useful solution is changing better privacy settings. If you're unable to remove Firefox history or cookies by using CC Cleaner, you might want to check better privacy settings. This is a useful Firefox extension, but it can cause problems such as this one to occur. If that's the case, open better privacy settings and enable delete flash cookies on application start option. After doing that, you'll be able to remove Firefox cookies and history with ease. And another useful solution could be using CC Cleaner Advanced File Deletion. If CC Cleaner can delete Firefox history or cookies, you might want to try this workaround. According to users, you can use CC Cleaner's Advanced File Deletion feature to remove history or cookies. Simply select the Firefox Cookies folder and remove it using CC Cleaner. This isn't the best solution, but it's a decent workaround that might work for you. And if you're having any issues with CC Cleaner and Firefox, be sure to try this solution. For more information and details, please check the article in the description below. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.